incredible claim by a respected Oxford researcher. He says he has proof that the Yeti, the abominable snowman of the Himalayas, is in fact real and its descendants are alive. ABC's Nick Watt has the story. The centuries-old myth of the Yeti, fueled by those grainy photographs, the monstrous footprints and our wild imaginations, might not be a myth after all. I've collected hair samples from um, creatures that are thought to have been yetis. One hair from a weird creature shot by a Himalayan bear hunter 40 years ago, the other found stuck to a bamboo shoot in a forest by a film crew just 10 years ago. Now the DNA from those mysterious Himalayan hairs, he says, just proved a 100% match with an ancient polar bear that died on an Arctic island more than 40,000 years ago. Leading our hirsute professor to make a startling claim. Yet he lives. It's some kind of new bear species that might be a hybrid. Smaller, says the professor, than the yetis we've seen in Monsters, Inc. Do I look abominable to you? Or that towering claymation yeti in those old Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer TV specials. Perhaps, says the professor, polar bears crossbred with brown bears tens of thousands of years ago and their mysterious descendants survive to this day, roaming high in these snowy mountains. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Los Angeles.